What is going on guys, today we're bringing you back another episode of Soul Hunters and I know this is a late upload, I just got off of work so I'm recording this real quick. We're just going to do our regular routine, our daily challenges and yeah, just bring y'all an episode. Oh, so the new Conjuring Stone hero is out, I'm not going to be going for him because I'd rather save my gems than go for him so... That's just in a personal opinion. Um, if you go for him and you get him, awesome. Um, but I personally will not be getting him. All right, let's open up 100 chests. I haven't opened up 100 chests in a while because, as you know, I haven't, like, actually streamed or recorded this game for a while. So, yeah. All right, nothing good there. Oh, let's get some arena attacks in. I can do that. I also am going to be upgrading my Radolf today, which I am super excited about that. I will finish him after I finish the Bountiful Cave, actually, so I won't even have to use Stamina. And also, for a disclaimer, I know I said Monday I would be getting my first part of the Awakening for a Sylphie done. I will not be getting that. That will be Tuesday. My math was a day off, but that's okay. Tomorrow we will be getting a four-star Sylphie in our live stream, so don't miss that. I am actually super excited about that, and the Awakened Sylphie will be coming um, very shortly after that. So let's just see if we can win this real quick. All right, we got our Radolf going. Oh, man, please kill his Zenos. Please. Just kill it before it does damage. Nice. Nelia, put in that work. All right, Gorum finishing off strong. Let's go. Don't get it. Don't get it, Jasmine. No. She got it. Damn it. She got off her attack. No. Yes. It could be a good yes, and it could be a good no. This really... Oh, if we, oh, I knew that was going to happen. Oh, it didn't kill Radolf. Never mind, we won. Oh, or the Neelia. I didn't even see Neelia. I was just looking at Radolf. So let's go. We got a little win right there. Hey, something's better than nothing. Let's go to exchange because I got a lot of coins saved up and Nelia has not been popping up for me some odd reason. I have no idea why, but she is super close to six stars. So that's really good. Um, the witch call it Seraphine hasn't even been popping up for me really lately. Maybe today she will. Mm, she actually popped up a little bit, less than a hundred soul stones before we can get her to seven. No, we gotta get five hundred. That's right. I'm thinking of two fifty. All right, Avior. We've been grinding Avior. Still grinding him. Still grinding Blood Spear. Now we need forty-five soul stones for Blood Spear. While, while, wow, that's a lot actually. But Avior, we are still killing it strong with him. Blood Spear, let's go. All right, let's check out our dailies. Let's just collect all of this. Hopefully, this clicker isn't as loud either. It's a new mouse, so hopefully, this sounds a lot, a lot better. Let's do our dojo so we can get our gear for the Radolf. Get him maxed out at um orange plus one. We gotta do that. All right, nice. Um, almost never went here. Sweet, we got this. Nice. Purchase that for sure. Can't, cannot pass that up. God like. All right, this is what we needed right here. Ninety-two out of eighty, and we needed um one of those. So there we go. We got the bountiful cave we got the money and we got the potion so it's a win-win for me if you ask me when is this 94 <whistles> one level away till we unlock the last difficulty which is absolutely awesome all right so we got the havoc all right i need to collect this real quick let me collect that then let me go to sylphie so we can finish off sylphie well not finish her off but you get what i mean let's 61 out of 80 Ugh. so far away give me a lot nice all right that was our last reset today we're sitting at 66 Ooh. all right it's not the best but we'll make do all right, nice. We got the arena, which is going to give us some more. Oh, yeah. Also, we got this gear for the raid loot. Forgot to mention that. Awesome. Oh, we even got one right here. 
What a duck. I didn't even notice that. So more diamonds. Heck yeah. All right. So our diamonds are looking pretty good. We got the Crucible of Fire. The Octo has not been popping up. And boom. There we go. We should be getting a five-star Octo right now. And that's really good because, as y'all know, as soon as I finish my Sylphie, we will be starting on the Octo to Awakening. And let's get our Octo to five-star. Nice. Because I actually like him. He's actually pretty good. Then let's go to our Red Off. Where are you at? There you are. Max out our Red Off craft. Boom. Equipped. There we go. Our Red Off is equipped some more. And I could be working on the Octo. I could put that gear for the Octo. Zenos would be pretty nice, but I'm just not a fan of these heroes right now. And I am going to be using Octo, so I might as well just knock it out the ballpark. And, oh, you're going to be using the good gear. Oh, 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 that hurts me. Yes, that hurts me a lot. That's a very, very, very precious gear to be having. And this is what we need to farm for level 94. Let's see where we're sitting at. All right, we're not sitting at too close, but I do need a lot of farming for that. So I may just start on the level 94 gear right now to just start on it. Ouch, this is, this is going to suck for the next, I don't know how many days, because I need, let me make sure we're in it for the raids. All right, heroic raids, I mean. Um, that would be very nice if we was to grab one of these. I'm going to just request it and hope that we get it because I really... Hey, new subscriber while recording. Thank you for subscribing, Shane Coina? Beyonce? Beyonce? Bounce? Something like that. But hey, thank you for subscribing. Hey, you got a feature in the video, man. Nice. Let me see if I got the email. Did get the email. Let's go. Awesome. That's what happens when your subscription status is on 9 private and you hit that subscribe button. You will pop up and that was just weird. Perfect timing, man. All right, let's attack one of these cuz before I went to work, I forgot to invite people. So yeah. All right, auto fight and then we got to go enchant our new gear for our rat off since it's not enchanted and yeah yeah just getting ready for that sylphie to awakening gear enchant that seven star oh she's gonna be a beast what are we gonna get what are we gonna get ouch i really needed these um i'm just trying to think real quick how about we finish raiding i'll buy it one more time and we're just slowly going to raid this. I know for a fact I'm going to need seven. So I'm going to need seven of these and seven of these. These are pretty much easier to get, it looks like, than these. I will raid for this, actually. Actually, no. I'm going to raid for the other one. The reason for that being is I get two for one special. Yes. All right, so let's raid raid all right that's good because we still have to do the privacy pool we can go check that out right now get that over with the havoc and we can go on extreme and this is the team we use if i had an awaken um dokris i'm pretty sure this is the dude that you beat it with but i mean we should just beat it easy with this team beat it every single time hopefully i didn't jinx myself I need to see when I open up the next difficulty. Just slowly reviving, and this is gonna take some heat on my Ling Ling, but that's all right. Bam, don't want none of this. We'll just use Ling Ling again, why not? Gotta keep Ling Ling's ult going. All right, so it looks like we did take some damage right there though. So that's not good, we lost our Gorum. Gorum does a lot of damage. That's why that sucks, but it's whatever, I guess. All right, let's rock the Kong. Wow, okay. The Kong's um, Ling Ling skill took, like, forever to go away. Bam, and that is a G to the double G. Why? Why are we losing so many heroes? I have no idea why we're losing so many heroes. All right, nice. When do you get this? 95. All right, so I have a long grind before we get there, 100%. It 
and let's try to auto fight it let's see if we can beat it on an auto fight this white shirt it does not go with a really white light but you know what as soon as i got home i didn't want to switch shirts because that's pointless i'd rather take a shower instead of wasting a whole nother shirt so that's why i just jumped in to start recording because i i have not posted a soul hunters video today and i'm trying to keep them on the daily because i know a lot of people want to see soul hunters not even gonna use Ling Ling's old. I just wanna use it by itself. Let's see how it goes. Ooh. Let's see though. Physical armor might might help us a little bit. I don't know. Already losing Gorm very early on. That's not looking good. I do wanna use that. Uh not too late. Yes. Oh well. Physical attack at least. Tried to at least use it a little bit to help out. But it's whatever. I don't know why we're not three starring it. Come on, use your ult, you fat goop. Yeah, I am gonna use that actually. Look how much damage we actually do. Because if y'all remember last time he used that ult, we finished him. So that's how much more damage we do with Ling Ling. Probably confused y'all, but some of y'all may have got what I meant. And that's a wrap. Nice. Thank you for being super easy and super cooperative. I appreciate it. Alright, back out of there. Let's see what other challenges we got. We got another arena, so let's hit up the arena real quick. Let's just basic basic attacks. That's all we need. Tomorrow we'll hit the live stream and fight like actually fight an arena. If we win this, awesome. If we don't, totally cool forgot to enchant the rat off that's not good oh 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 nice nice tashi by him 100 percent. wow that tashi did work this time normally the tashis do not do that good to me but that's all right props to him i give him that he's definitely gonna win this one i would not um g to the double g Boom. All right, come on, Gorum. Just quit trying to fight everyone, bro. Imagine if my Gorum lived by itself. That would be insane. We actually almost killed his Nelia. If we would have killed his Nelia right there, that would have been pretty clutch. All right, so we lost that one. That's all right though. Can't win them all. Enchant, Red off, and. Once I awaken my Sylphie, I think I'm going to put her in my arena team, especially since she's going to be four star. Hopefully it will be worth it. And I know a lot of people like the Crucible Fire. I know a lot of people don't like the Crucible Fire. So I think I'm going to do the Crucible Fire at the end of the video. We're about to go do the raids. I, I personally hate doing these raids. It's against those hard people. There you go. That's good enough collect that all right we'll finish that finish that and yeah let's go do some raids real quick raid dungeon we got chapter 14 and 15 um all right time out let me get my booklet oh all right because you already know what's good we got the timing down all right so we want to use our basic teams zim gorum's really good ling ling if we get our timing correct, um, we'll be able to use Sylphie. Yeah, let's do it. If we, we just gotta get our timing correct. All right, so at 110 up here, if you see my mouse up there, um, he's gonna use his second silence attack because I don't count the first one. This is a guide for y'all too. If y'all wanna write these numbers down or whatever, I'm gonna teach all this. Hopefully I can get my timing correct. Like 110, boom. All right, so at 55 seconds, you want to use Ling Ling. That's what I have wrote down, so I'm guessing that's what you got to do. At 55 seconds. And action. 55. All right, so 56. Pretty sure that's 56. That's all right. Now at 29... He's going to use his um, ult again. So at 29, now at 34, you want to use this then. Fuck. 
I was super close. I I just hmm. So at 35 that I use it. Maybe 36 then. Damn it. I told y'all the times that he's going to do it. It's just, it really all comes down to timing. I need to fix this though. All right, so maybe 56 you use Ling Ling. Let's try that. 56 use Ling Ling. This is a guide. <laughs> That's what this is right here. Because if you can get Sylvie off and like keep controlling these, it would be a great, great, great one. I'm not really down to, I'm not really worried about doing too much damage, honestly. I'm just kind of like, enjoy and get the timing because, all right. So it takes four seconds for him to do that when he uses that. So maybe 56 is the, yeah, maybe 56 is what you got to do. All right, so 56, as soon as that hits 56, I'm going for it. <sighs> Boom. As soon as it hit 56, I hit it. Perfect. Okay. So 56 worked. All right. Nice. All right. So now when you use all of that, of course, that's going to throw the timings off. Oh, I never thought about that. But honestly, if I get one of them right, I'd be pretty happy. At 29, he's supposed to use it. Is he still going to use it at 29? No, it's a little bit off. All right. Oh, 26, he used it. Okay. Okay. Hmm, interesting. Definitely good timing though. No doubts about that. Um, 26 he used it after you... Alright, so after you get it off... Hmm, 26. Maybe I'll remember. Maybe I'll remember that. Um, if you get it right. Maybe I'll remember that. Maybe I won't remember that. what that's for. But honestly, that's pretty good. Sylphie did really well for that. I could have used broken arms. Didn't even think about it. Actually, I'll use broken arms. No, I don't think I used Sylphie for this fight. Um, whoa. All right, I normally use, like, this team. Maybe I'll try a Sylphie instead of... Okay, so Sylphie instead of Bloodspear... Um, Nelia. All right, let's try this first with my team, and then we'll use Broken Arm 7 Star Sylphie. That's honestly what we actually do need to use because um, this chapter is way more important than Chapter 14, so I'm kind of glad I didn't use his Sylphie there. Yeah, that came that came in really, really good handy, actually. Nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Time out. He, she don't even have her shield up. Get out of here, bro. What in the world? What? She didn't even have her shield up. Oh, that's AIDS. All right. It's all right, though. We're just trying to last as long as possible. Any damage is definitely good. If I do one mil damage, I'm definitely happy here. I don't ever intend to do one mil. But Nelia does do a lot of work here. All right, Nelia's dead. It's all up to Sylphie with the damage. Come on, keep going. All right, quit dodging. All right, give me her one more time. There we go. Come on, do work. Stop dodging. Why is she dodging so much? Look at these hits. What? What? All right. I mean, I'm fine with it. I mean, we're just getting extra damage dealt. Ooh, -wee! barely surviving. Let's go. All right, let's try broken arms. All right, 1.6 million. I'm I'm pretty happy with that. I physically don't understand why that happened. All right, let's go higher. Oh, broken arm. <laughs> new hero i could do a hero review maybe that that's what i probably should have did for today's video i know y'all probably wanted to see the new hero review of me personally i'll do that tomorrow on live stream how about that yeah 
we'll do that tomorrow on live stream because I personally cannot tell y'all what I think about the hero. We'll hire him for the Crucible Fire on live stream and we'll check out all of his attacks. So tomorrow there will be a live stream. This is going up the day of recording. So yes, tomorrow Monday the 24th there will be a live stream everyone we're gonna use broken arms new hero we're gonna check him out i have no idea what he even is like I've never even looked at a hero view so we're gonna i'm actually excited now i didn't even know broken had him at 93 so i'm just hoping broken arm leaves him at 93 that would be very very nice i'm gonna text them on here after i get done recording hopefully he sees the message to where he can leave him at 93 so i can do a stream on him tomorrow and yeah for everyone that wants to check him out i'm sure broken did a stream on him because he got him the four star if y'all want to check that out give him a little shout out right there all right so this one was a lot better i guess our garrick actually timed everything right this time because I personally do not understand how our Gorum died right there at the beginning of the last one. Give me, give me, Sylphie. Come on. Boom. There we go. All right. A little bit extra. We definitely did a lot, a lot of damage right here. Hopefully, like, 2.5, 3 million. 3.4. I'll definitely take that. Very, very good. Um sweet 360 all right y'all for the rest of the people that want to um watch the crucible of fire that will be the last bit of this video if you don't want to watch it i i totally understand the crucible of fire is not the best but hey i mean i am gonna pop it up oh we could um rock a five star hmm yeah let's try a five star gorum even though it's not probably not awakened but that's all right and jasmine where is my jasmine there she is all right let's go with this team and see how it actually rocks and works and works and rocks and yeah five star gorm i wish mine was five star it'd be so much better Ooh, i'd be wrecking Ooh, just hit my ring light i'd be wrecking if that thing was five star all right, we'll rock our Gorum. Boom. Ooh, that thing actually did some work right there. I'm trying not to hit my cables. I got so many dang cables. I got a new headset and all that. If you haven't checked out that live stream on CS, yeah, we got a new headset. I'll be showing it tomorrow. I don't know why I want to say later. All right, let's rock this and put the prints down in the middle of everyone. And hopefully, oh crap, I was hoping it gets into the Firehawk. As soon as this Firehawk gets off its attack. Yep, not happening. No thanks. Perfect, and we're going to have everyone's ability. Nice. This 5-star Gorm actually makes a difference. My 3-star one, I've used it. It's not that good. This thing is actually rocking for this um crusade crucible fire whatever you want to call it let's see how much damage boom just an average yeah about an average damage all right i freaking forgot about tanya should he use that faster oh well um let's use this and stun this nice thunder stun oh my gosh this prince just came in clutch today nice Stunned her also. Gorm's gonna finish. Nope, Gorm will not. Alright, we don't have Zim and Prince, but that's okay. Alright, 24 minutes. Ooh, this is actually gonna be a long video. People that like long videos, here y'all go. Because I will finish the whole Crucible of Fire for y'all. Because I, I don't really show that off as much. Um, we'll save the Zim for next one. Get rid of this Riley. Oh my goodness. Actually, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to get rid of the Prince real quick. 
I'm just gonna try to speed up this video a little bit because this is gonna be a very 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 long video if I just keep doing the same moves over and over so I will hit up my old routine where you use the Taurus with Ling Ling and it just does so much damage I think we'll be fine all right and the Zim's doing work all right we're gonna see how this old technique works Let's see 44,000 not too bad Gorum, then zoom, why not, yeah. Bam, and then you hit the Taurus. Taurus is going to put in his work. Boom, bam, and that just does it. Yeah, look how much faster that was. Took a lot of HP out of everyone. And now we don't have Ling Ling, and that's okay, because I'm going to use the Gorum when I get it, then Taurus, and then, yeah. We'll see how that goes. Hopefully that works out. All I'm doing is looking for this. All right, then we'll hit both of these because it does damage to all of them. The Notorious and we'll use Jasmine. And Taurus will probably kill them all. No thing. 87,000 gold, which is pretty actually good still racking up my gold don't physically don't understand how i have this much gold again after i just did a 45 million gold chest opening video so yeah that's pretty dumb lit um nice all right i was hoping the taurus wouldn't hit that kong if it did i was gonna restart this for sure all right we're doing really well right now. See, this Taurus, if you want to beat the Crucible Fire pretty fast, I would definitely say use the Taurus. But if you want to be um, casual and fun with it, I'd say use the Prince. Because the Prince is really fun to use in the Crucible Fire. And tomorrow, we're going to try the new hero. Oh, yeah, you can hit Tanya. That's fine. Somehow we just killed that Taurus. I have no idea how. Um, I don't want to waste my Zim. Oh, man. This is going bad right now. It's this is damn Lumos on this Zenos. God, dude. Some odd reason this um, freaking Zenos had its ability so much. Why does it have its ability so long? Gosh, it had that ability way too long. Oh my gosh, and this damn Tanya. I didn't think it was going to go back that fast. <sighs> man, oh man. Oh my God, how does my Taurus do that, man? God, we're taking some heat real quick. Kill it. Nice. Thank goodness. That was way too close. Alright, so... Boom. Okay, there we go. That was a very, very good one. It would just help keep Zim's ability right there. All right, we need to get this Jasmine one more time so we can heal up. And then hopefully we'll be fine with that. I don't know, I'm just trying to beat this real quick. Definitely don't want to use that. All right, we'll use Ling Ling. And we'll use Jasmine while using Ling Ling. Didn't hit the Zenos. Hell yeah. That's what I was hoping for right there. And we got it. No, no. Super close to killing her. And she gets off her attack. I guess it's actually pretty good that she got off her attack though. Since um, now we got all of our abilities. And we can use Jasmine and Taurus again with Ling Ling. Because that's actually a really good combo. 
then we'll probably have around like 36 million almost after we do all of our raids i mean our sweep stages and finish the crucible fire and then we'll be grinding again y'all bam let's go look at this combo look at this i forgot to hit the damn fucking gorum ah i just should have used the gorum and then it would have killed the taurus freak maybe the prince is better slow and steady is a lot better definitely a lot better because now i'm not even close to killing this taurus okay there we go thank you zim all right y'all this is uh this is probably one of my longest videos i've ever recorded feels like um All right, we'll rock both of these. Come on. No, dude. What in the world? Yeah, just stop there, Taurus. Don't even do it. There we go. Okay, so now we got to use another. We'll actually use the prince real quick. Um. Alright. Had to send that real quick. Because I did not think this video was going to be this long. Um, fucking Taurus on the other team, dude. I swear. I hate going up against another Taurus. Oh. Alright, we got one more stage, y'all. I'm sorry for making this video this long. I just, I didn't, if I knew it was going to be this long, I wouldn't have did the Crucible of Fire. But it's alright. Some people like the Crucible of Fire, some people don't. Boom and auto fight. We should be able to beat this, hopefully, because if we lose all our heroes, I'm not restarting, and we'll pick some new heroes. All right, some. Boom. There's the Jasmine. Of course, this freaking Ezio is still alive. It's probably a seven-star awakened Ezio. next and nothing come on give me something give me something nothing good with hero wise and honestly that stuff at the top was our best gear we got wow all right so we're basically at 36 million as i said so hopefully y'all enjoyed this episode if you did drop a like on the video if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button and like i said tomorrow's live stream we will be working on the new hero we're well, not working on him we're gonna be testing him out see what he's all about and yeah hopefully i'll see some of y'all then peace out everyone and i'll see you tomorrow if i don't then see you when the video uploads peace out everyone